when I was a boy and I would see scary things on the news, my mother would say to me, look for the helpers. You will always find people who are helping. Beardos, beard fans, villains. Welcome to Villainous Vox, a voice for the villains. My name is John Wade, I'm your host for the thought for the day, and today we're looking at another quote from Mr. Rogers, who had this to say. He said, when I was a boy and I would see scary things in the news, my mother would say to me, look for the helpers. You will always find people who are helping. The news is full of scary things nowadays. It's full of tragedy and heartache. It's full of things that make us afraid for the future, that fill us with uncertainty. So how do we combat the depression how do we combat the feeling of hopelessness, that feeling of waiting for the other shoe to drop? We look for the helpers. We look for the people who care, who serve, for those who are helping their fellow human beings through these times. And it is in finding those people that I think we are able to see a little bit of hope. There are always helpers. In every culture around the world, when crisis hits, there are people who run from whatever's going on. And there are people who run towards what's going on. There are people who are looking to save themselves, and there are those who are looking to help others. And I think in looking at those who have that attitude of, it's my problem too, instead of that's your problem, I think in looking at those people that we see a beautiful side of humanity and that it gives us hope, that it encourages us and builds us in times of trouble. Look for the helpers. What form do helpers take? Helpers come in various shapes and sizes and titles. Helpers can be Firefighters, they can be police officers, they can be Boy Scouts, they can be literally a stranger who stops to help someone in need on the side of the road. Helpers come in forms that we may not think would be the helper. I'm reminded of the magical helper archetype from storytelling. If you're not familiar with storytelling and kind of the fundamentals of storytelling, there's always kind of this, this helper that shows up in most good stories. And we call it the magical helper. The magical helper is somewhat mysterious, but shows up right when the need is greatest. For example, Gandalf is a magical helper in the story of both Bilbo and Frodo Baggins. He is a figure that provides aid in times of trouble and really thinks very little about himself and more about the people that he is trying to serve. We need to look for our magical helpers in times of trouble. Find who the helpers are in the story. And I think it will give us hope. So look for those helpers, friends. May we be the people who find hope as we see the good things that happen every day, as well as people help other people. So that's the thought for the day today on Villainous Vox, a voice.
for the villains. Until next time, y'all know what to do. Be good and box on.